late in the afternoon, and Jimmy is finding some of my caches because he's only found a few, so he's finding a bunch of mine. There's one in this bush here. He's putting it back right now. Good? Yeah. Cool. Now I'm going to log my find. We are finding my caches. More of them, we went to the point, which is what this cache is called. And we are now looking for another place to hide another one on and the way back. Perhaps. Here's a picture of me because I've been looking just forward for the last couple clips. Well, perhaps if uh, there Burns. were another cache in this location, people would find the point more often. Yes. So maybe the point needs like It has five finds since I published it like five months ago. So doesn't get found very often, but it is like a half mile hike there and back, so that's probably why people don't go for it all the time. Um, yeah, you can kind of see the buildings over there. So anyway, we're going to try and find a new spot to hide one, and then go back to the truck and continue finding my caches until the sun goes down. Well, the sun is going down right now. The sun is always going down. Well, not if it's going up. Two helicopters are flying by. Pretty cool. The green one and the red one. Not sure where they're going. Cool though. We're probably gonna hide our cash in this bush. Everything looks yellow for some reason. Come on, white balance, come back. There's the sunset. Kind of windy. I apologize. So it's good. Yeah. Cool. They're actually pretty well hidden. Yeah, you looked all around from all sides, and it's like you can't really see it. Cool. It's another one. Sun is going down further. We are at my cache called Eucalyptus Vanishing Act, and I am letting Jimmy try to find it. He actually saw the video where I made the container, so he knows what it looks like. I don't know exactly what it looks like. I haven't seen the video in a long time. Oh. But anyway, the container that I made a video of making it, that's what he's looking for right now. And I'll give you a, a hint. Your flashlight has been directly on it already. Twice. Twice. He found it. It didn't take that long. You like the container? Mm-hmm. We're going to the last one of the day for Jimmy. He's going to one of my caches. It's over next to this sort of power thing. And I think he's found it. Yep. He has is a block of wood with a nano in it. That's not a nano, it's a bison. Oh, the bison, whatever. Pretty good one. I won that at an event. Alright, cool. Hello. This is Jimmy, and I am speaking with a uh, fraction of a delay <laughs> echo. <laughs> it's kind of a, difficult to speak this way. You said a fraction of a delay. Uh, you should, like, um, make should the delay change. a little bit less so it's more difficult for me. Yeah. So... It's kind of annoying right Basically, now. we read an article, the Chinese have developed a device that you can point at somebody and it will render them inoperable to speak. And basically what it does is... Basically, it's got a directional it microphone and a directional it, it, yeah, uh, it, speaker. It does a of a so thing. when you speak into it, it'll play back your voice speak slightly delayed. It. And when you're hearing yourself talking right after you've just spoken, it makes it really hard to talk. So we have Sorry, simulated that. Thinking. With this, we have a delay, and I found out like about two uh, is pretty good. So the microphone that he's got right there will play into the delay module and then it will output to the speakers 
and I'm going to try to try and talk. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to recreate the effect while hearing what you were saying in, Whoops. The, in the headphones. Hold on. I was trying to recreate the attempt, hence the, uh, okay. recreate the effect, hence me interrupting Mike. I will attempt to read this. <laughs> <laughs> or something. It's so difficult to talk <laughs> when you have it yourself. <laughs> I think it's a little easier for me because, like... I think it is too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's going to try reading that. Earn points everywhere. Get the stuff you want. <laughs> it sounds funny. Welcome to Amazon Doc. <laughs> <laughs> Amazon Doc Caro. <laughs> it's like it's the simple way to get what you will <laughs> <laughs> with the stuff you want. <laughs> oh man, it's so hard to talk when you hear yourself talking to yourself. It's like. Oh, you just get so confused. How about uh, record me? You try it again. Okay. It's like as soon as you start talking, you just go. Blah, blah. Earn points everywhere. Get the stuff you want. I just slow down. Yeah. Try Earn to read points it. everywhere. You can. Okay, I'll try to talk in normal speed. Read it at a normal okay. speed. Earn points everywhere. You can always earn points with a, your Amazon.com <laughs> rewards, <laughs> rewards Visa card. Three points for one dollar spent on Amazon.com purchases. Two points for one dollar spent on eligible gas, drug store, office supply store. Um, Okay, I'll try to talk normally right now, as I am talking to you right now is very weird, but, you know, I could talk, try talking normally, but it kind of requires a lot more thought, because, like, you know, it's, that's why I'm, like, a little bit slowed down. <laughs> You're pretty it good at that. Sounds funny. Yeah. Okay, right now, there's no echo, and I can talk just fine. So I'm going to try and read these alto types instructions. <laughs> he just clicked the button. Oh, he clicked it again. I'm good. These altoids are made of sugar, <laughs> gum arabic, natural and artificial flavors, gelatin colored blue one and yellow five. Yeah. So that's what happens when Jimmy pushed the button. 